Hey, ¿qué tal a todos? Sean bienvenidos una vez más al panes de Retro. Les traigo la misión número 38 para que la vean y me callo para que puedan apreciar la cinemática. Motherfucker! That mute asshole! That fucking snake without a tongue! Gave me this shithole instead of a pink slip! I must be the biggest fucking idiot in the whole fucking world! Holmes, take it easy. At least we're alive. Girl! Friend, fellow traveler, relax, man. You're really killing my fucking vibe here. Well, I'm sorry I'm fucking up your vibe, old man, but I can't wait to get my hands on that mute and your bitch-ass cousin. My cousin? You're gonna diss my familia? My bad, man. I'm just pissed for all of us. I mean, look, we in a strange place, we got shit to our name, and for once, I try to make something work this garage, And it ain't even a garage. Then make it into a garage. Oh, that's a great idea, sis. Won't you shut up? You know what, Carl? You are a fucking idiot. Your whole life you wanted something for nothing. Now you've got something and you don't know what to do with it. We'll make it good enough. We'll help, right? We got your back, CJ. Come on, stop tripping, man. Both of you. Whoa, man, the energy here is fantastic. Oh. Yeah, uh, all right. But how am I gonna find some good mechanics to work up in here, man? I know a few guys. Come with me, friend. They're good people, I swear it. Oh, man, I'm about to ride with this fool again. Come on, man. There's these two guys I know. Used to work on marine engines. Till the mob bought their business over in Vice. Now they try and make ends meet by taking any old job. They're a little bit dull by their habit, but the smoke don't get in the way of their skills with an engine. We'll pick up Jethro first. Last I heard he was working at a garage over in East Basin. Hey man, how you meet these dudes anyway? I met them at the 89th Year 11, apparently. Apparently? You know how it is, man. Field of tents, crazy ass music. A quart of mescaline vodka, polar bears. Polar bears? Yeah, go figure. They're funny guys, man. Great sense of humor. Oh. This here's Vietnamese gang territory. Tang boys, shining razors, butterfly children. Watch yourself, dude. These cats are real serious. Hey, Jethro. Hop in, man. I've landed you a real job. Hey there, Truth Dude. Oh, man. Do, do I owe you? Cause I swear I paid for that weed, dude. No, man, we're good. I think. Jethro, Carl. Carl, Jethro. What's up, man? Can we swing by the hospital? It's over in Santa Flora District. West of here. Yeah. You sick? No. The government is. But that's a long story. So, you know, like, what's the deal, dudes? I'm up in the garage in Doherty by the waste ground. You know, car mods, low riders, all that shit. You down? To polar bear shit in the woods. No, but they've been known to shit in the liquor tent, if I remember it right. Yeah, that was like... Perfecto people, ¿cómo están todos? Ahora sí estamos, ya se acabaron más o menos los diálogos por así decirlo Estamos tranquilamente manejando, por... uy lo siento, lo siento Estamos tranquilamente aquí manejando por el gran San Fierro Y bueno, a seguir, uy lo siento, lo siento chavales, lo siento muchísimo Y como saben amigos, yo me dedico, bueno, por lo general, o siempre mejor dicho me callo cuando hay cinemáticas, diálogos o cosas realmente importantes porque no tengo la intención de interrumpir y pues sí, así es más entretenido, creo yo. What we here for anyway? Nothing. Oh, don't look. Cover your faces. Think about a yellow rubber duck. You tripping again. Shh. Okay. I've seen enough. Let's go see if we can find Wayne. He's working a hot dog van at the tram terminal in Kings. Come on, dude, what's all that about? You don't want to know. Why? Do you know what a subdermal neurophone is? A what? Exactly. Sometimes it's best to stay in the dark, kid. Todo es misticismo por parte del viejo Trude. Realmente, esta misión 
Eh, las cosas que nos decía eran un verdadero misterio que nunca fueron resueltas, de verdad. Uy, oh, no, la cagué aquí. A ver, ahora sí nos estacionamos bien. Y le tocamos el pilín, digo, el claxon. Ahí está. Dude, Dwayne, man, how's the hot dog business? It's totally shit. Why? What's happening? Uh, my friend Carl here is opening a chop shop. Jethro's in. How about you? Uh, yeah, cool, man. Uh, I've got like some shit to take care of first, though. So, uh, you tell me where you guys are gonna be at, and I'll meet you dudes there. The garage is on the waste grounds in Doherty. I'll see y'all later. Okay, next stop, cop station downtown. What? You want your mom? Why? If I told you, the likelihood is you'd get a probe up your ass within a month. Like, listen to the man, dude. He's real serious about that shit. Well, uh, okay, but you're starting to freak me out with all that space shit, man. Pues bueno, ahora sí seguimos nuestro trayecto. Como les digo, Truth es demasiado, demasiado misterioso. Así que nada, simplemente me voy a limitar a seguir con nuestra ruta y seguir conociendo al, al que sigue, ¿no? Creo que toca cero, me parece. Sí, ya conocimos a Dwayne, Jetro y ahora seguiría a cero, me parece. Que forma parte de las misiones secundarias también, por cierto, como toca las pelotas el buen cero, pero bueno. Creo que sí es cero, ¿no? Si no, ¿quién sería? Ah, no, todavía no tenemos que ir a... A un lugar que nos dijo Truth Ok, you know the drill Don't look interested in anything Picture a pink golf ball in your mind Ok, we're good to go Where to next, spacehead? There's an electronics guy I've had dealings with Goes by the name of Zero He could fix a supercomputer with a paperclip He's got his own shop, but he's always ready to help fellow travelers along the path. Let's go introduce you to him. Look, what's going on, True? Who was him do? Don't go there, man. Listen to Jethro. Now, what if I told you we never went to the moon? JFK lives in Scotland with Janis Joplin. And the only reason we've been in a Cold War for the last 45 years was because snake-headed aliens run the oil business. I think you popped another micro, Doc. Good. Keep it that way. Ahora sí, como ya pudieron observar en los diálogos, vamos a ir a ver al buen cero que dice, dice Truth que es un tipo súper inteligente que puede arreglar una supercomputadora con un clip y que el tipo siempre está dispuesto a ayudar a los demás. Así que bueno, vamos a por el buen cero. Uy, 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 estoy manejando del culazo, pero bueno, sigamos hacia el indicador rojo. Leave me alone, Berkeley. This is stalking. Oh, hey, Truth. Get in. I'll fill you in as we drive. Home, James. Carl, zero. Zero, Carl. Sup? Carl here is opening a garage around the corner. I told him you're the man to speak to when it comes to electronics. <laughs> Actually, I'm the only man to speak to. <laughs> Grade A tip-top genius. That's me. You should drop by... Okay, be here. A week of hard work, we'll transform this place. Hey, Caesar, come over here. What's up, B? Caesar, this Jethro, Dwayne, and Zero. Hey, man. Dude. Salutations, my sibling. Orale, let's get to work. Hey, hey, Carl, look. I think I found a way for us to get paid. I ain't going to no college to study no account. No, idiot. Property. Decorating ain't exactly my thing either. No, property development, look. Buy a dump like this, fix it up, and sell it. Or better yet, you turn the property into a business. Snowball gets bigger. I don't know, sis. This all sound big time to me. Look, Carl, this place is gonna get on its feet, and when it does, we are gonna have money. If you wanna make something of yourself, you gotta let your money work for you. Look, I wouldn't even know where to start. Look, to concentrate on the garage and let me work the property thing, okay? Yeah, that's my baby girl right there, Holmes. <laughs> Man, you chose her. I'm stuck with her. <laughs> Perfecto, entonces aquí en pantalla les aparecerá la misión número 39 para que le den click y nos vemos en el próximo. Bye bye, people.